Okay. I think he's. I think he's annoyed because we don't have our um, number plate showing. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay. Hola. Good morning from Mexico. We are in probably one of the most beautiful campsites we've ever been to. Unreal. You can see behind us. Oh my gosh, it's just amazing. And we got here two days ago, but yesterday we took off of filming and working because if you watched our last video, you'll be happy to know we actually took our own advice. Yeah. And we just, Oh, yeah, yesterday was so nice. It was so relaxing. Other than we had a little bit of a panic because the fridge broke. Funny story, the fridge stopped working this morning, which is a complete catastrophe because we spent, wait for it, over $900 in Whole Foods before we left the US because we were stocking up for months of things that we couldn't get, which we were going to keep frozen, and some stuff refrigerated. So when the fridge stopped working, obviously, we completely panicked and I thought we'd broken it. And the fridge is built in, so it's very hard to get to her behind to check the wires and stuff. Amazingly, there's this hatch here to access the back of the fridge. And I've just knocked a wire and it turned back on again. And I think the plug has rattled loose whilst driving. So I'm just gonna reach my hand in, plug it all back in. I'm so relieved. That would have been a huge effort trying to find a replacement fridge in rural Mexico. Anyway, I think we're okay. Um, let me see. See if it's uh, okay. Okay. Right, do you want to try the clicker on the stove as well? Hell yeah! Yeah, the whole plug had just rattled loose. Okay. Crisis averted. Oh, I love solving problems. I don't always love the process of it, but I love it once the problems are solved. I, I usually love the process of it as well. Okay. Like Raya said, yesterday we took the whole day off. There's a pool, we chilled by the pool, there's hammocks. Mm -hmm. It was just what we needed, just mm -hmm. to have a bit of a reset before like the hecticness of road tripping and <laughs> hours and hours of driving. And we also did some yoga, a little bit of like morning stretching mm -hmm. on the roof yesterday, which felt so good. So we're gonna do it again this morning before we head out. <laughs> yeah, and then we've got a little bit of cleaning up and yeah. prepping on the bus to do, mm -hmm. which we're gonna do after this. But mm -hmm. I think starting the day off Relaxed. Relaxed, centered. <laughs> yeah. It's what we need. Yeah. We found this place. Um, I was watching a ton of YouTube videos of other people crossing the border and stuff and where they recommended, and this was on that video. So, yeah, we will definitely leave the name of it in the description mm. below if any of you are passing through Mexico. Although, I would it. say it's not designed for RVs or buses. We only just fit in mm -hmm. and we broke a few small branches on the, on the entry. <laughs> <laughs> Look how close this tree is to the top. But yeah. Uh, yeah, smaller vans, this mm -hmm. is like the perfect spot. Yeah. Okay, I've downloaded a few yoga videos, so here we go. This is quite funny. Obviously we have our ladder on the back of the bus to get on and off the roof, but we opt normally just to climb in and out of the roof hatch, which is easier for me because I can kind of step on that and like hoist myself up, but I'll show you how Raya gets in and out. This is really funny. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> so some of the daily routines that we're trying to get into are obviously stretching, yoga, 
exercise. Raya's got her cell cycle bike and I'm doing some chin ups. And then I'm also trying to do daily Spanish lessons, which I need to do a lot of because I have got zero Spanish. Yeah, but now that we're here, like once you're immersed in it, it's so much easier to learn and practice. Yeah, yeah. I'm the just, lessons definitely help. I'm terrible at languages in general, so I need a lot of yeah. practice. Okay, and another thing we're trying to do daily is make sure the bus is tidy, which we didn't do yesterday, it was our day off, and now it's gotten a little bit out of control, which yeah. is what happens in a tiny space. Plus so. we bought so much stuff that we <laughs> yeah. have just got bags of food knocking around and boxes and... Yeah, just because before we left the US we were like, what are all the things we love that we might not be able to find once we leave the US? Mm. So we definitely stocked up, but now it's, it's just a mess, so... Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Okay, we're going to do a blitz quick clean. Do this. Right, the bus is almost tidy. Well, ish. But now we gotta clean it. Yeah. <laughs> It's pretty dusty here as well, so it needs a lot of cleaning. It's very, very dry air here. It's crazy, I've never been to like middle of Mexico, I've only been to the coast, the tropics, so I've never seen like dry desert Mexico, but I guess quite a lot of Mexico is like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So as you know, we installed the AC unit which we haven't used yet. It's not quite hot enough that we desperately need AC, but we have bought an addition for the windows so we can have the windows open without flies and mosquitoes getting in. So these just like slot in with the window open, these little bug nets. How cool are those? And they're very necessary. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we accidentally um, opened the windows yesterday without them and about 50 billion flies flied into the yeah. bus. There's still That's a few. an accurate assessment. <laughs> There's still a few knocking around, but... Oh, right, we... We need to go. Need to go to make sure we get to the next spot before it gets dark. I think, I don't know if we're gonna make it. I think it's gonna be a little bit dark by the time we get there. We're gonna do a quick, we'll pull the bus around the front and then we'll quickly show you this amazing campsite. And like what I said, we'll link it below as well if you want to come through. Oh, I'm going to miss this place. This is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Hello. Excuse me, we're about to go. Hello. You can't stay there. Hello. Hello. Aww. Can we bring, can we bring you with us? <laughs> oh, but we do need to move. I'm sorry, doggy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't want to disturb him. Come on. <laughs> oh. Come on. Ooh. That is exactly why we don't really fit in here. So many low trees. about to leave but as promised we're gonna take you on a quick tour to show you this campground it was really cheap I think we don't obviously we don't have anything to compare it to yet so maybe it's expensive for Mexico but we paid $50 for two nights and again we showed you how stunning it is with the mountains and there's a pool a restaurant okay let us show you around this is the check-in office and it says they've got a gear shop and laundry and taxis and all that stuff. Wi-Fi. Yeah, there's Wi-Fi which we've been using. There's a communal kitchen in there and these are barbecues that people have all been sharing and hanging out every night. There's people here like drinking beer and just, yeah, making friends. And there is their restaurant, which we didn't get to eat because we were trying to use up all our food yesterday. Yeah. Because we, we thought panicked. our fridge had broken. <laughs> but it did look really good. Um, there's tons of accommodation options, like check out this glamping, yeah. amazing little bell tent. These are so cool, and a lot of people bring their own tents too. By the way, a lot of rock climbers come here. I guess this is like an epic place to climb, so that's definitely most of the crowd here is like outdoorsy kind of rock climbing people. Oh yeah, here are the bathrooms. We've got women's and men's. 
and there were hot showers and yeah, just great. And then this is the nicest area. There's hammocks over there. We were laying there yesterday. This pool is way colder than you would think. <laughs> yeah, it's basically an ice bath. It is like doing an ice bath. <laughs> okay, before we go, I think we should put our feet in. <laughs> to cool off. If you come here another time of year, let us know if the pool is any warmer. <laughs> accelerator just suddenly go pop and it's like not doing anything so it makes me feel like the throttle cables have got disconnected uh, okay I think I fixed it okay uh, shall I show you what I did I just popped open the uh, the bonnet and saw that this was like hanging loose, and I think that's supposed to clip onto here. So, I'm gonna clip that back on. Let's hope that that worked. Ugh. Wow, that was scary. I really hope that's the, that's the only issue. Okay, moving at the tree. Yeah! <laughs> Amazing! Yeah! <laughs> Just stopped off. This guy's giving me a good windscreen clean. I don't know how big it was. Yes, bro. I think he's, I 
think he's annoyed because we don't have our um, number plate showing. Yeah, that's true. Hola. What happened? He just looked at the documents. He asked me about a few simple questions, and then he said, "Safe travels." Wow. And just told us to go on. Oh, amazing! I guess he just wanted to check we had this like permit to be in Mexico. Yeah. Oh, my heart <laughs> is racing. Do you know right. what though? One of the bikes has fallen off the <gasps> thing. Oh my gosh! So I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna. Okay. This is like the main thing we've been worried about. It's getting stopped by police, and there's just so many stories of corrupt police asking for bribes and and worse. Um, huh. My heart's racing too. But just a little sign that there's obviously good people everywhere as well. And What's been going on? Okay, very eventful evening. <laughs> Things have calmed down now. But we had a crazy 20 minute drive up these windy roads to find this campsite. We squeezed it. Firstly, we drove into someone's driveway, which Raya said it was someone's driveway. <laughs> I was like, no, this is the way. Anyway, turned up to someone's house, turned around, got to this campsite. I don't think we can fit into the campsite. The restaurant that we were hoping to go to is closed. So we're going to check out in the morning. But Raya's cooked this delicious spaghetti, mushroom, tomato dish. Mm -hmm. And we're watching our show mm -hmm. and just relaxing after a full day of driving. Yeah, you did so well. Thank Thanks. you. Thanks. Thanks for dinner. Yeah. Mm. Check this out. The box is literally hanging off. It's broken the welds. And uh, I'm going to have to weld this back on tonight because uh, we can't drive like that and it really sucks. Mm -hmm. 